Whiskey Barter here with WhereTheyBuck.com, eight rounds down. Uh, we're here with the Justin Sports Medicine team's Mike Rich. Uh, Mike, starting the time event into the arena. Let us know who's hurting. Yeah, round eight gets through. I mean, a lot of guys are just getting beat up. I mean, it's chronic injuries we see all year long, like with Bray Arms, low back. We treated it all year long. He threw it out a couple rounds ago. He's doing better, though. We're limping him through. Charlie Crawford, same deal. Chronic low back, threw it out yesterday, trying to get him through. Uh, Cody Ohl's got that chronic neck issue. I mean, his arm will go completely numb sometimes when it's flared up. So we work on him every day trying to get him through, too. All right, and on the Buck and Shoot side, anybody that was watching last night, obviously seen J-Dub got wrecked out. Uh, how's he doing? He's doing good. He was just in this morning in there. and I mean, he's, J-Dub's a tough egg. I mean, he's got some stitches over his eye, a nice black eye, chunk of hide off the back of his head gone. And the biggest concern tonight, though, is going to be the MCL in his right knee, where he got mucked out. It tore that ligament. Not complete, but it's something we got to figure out a way to protect it tonight, put him back on. All right, Cody Wright, we know he turned out last night. And because he turned out... Um, it takes you out of the next round, so he's out tonight, and then he's going to take those two days and see if he's coming back. We're going to see him tomorrow night. Yeah, it's going to be hard to say. Cody Wright's a veteran. He's a smart kid. Depends on what kind of pin of horses they got, how strong they are. It's his riding arm. He's got to lift pretty good with that, and we'll evaluate him tomorrow morning, have him lift on some stuff. You know, there's a way we can protect it. It's almost better than a free arm. It's going to be whipped behind your head, so we may try to tape it, have him lift on some stuff, and kind of make it day-to-day -day decision with him when we get there. Yeah, last but not least, Cowboy Lifesavers, uh, Dusty kind of took a beating last night on top of some of the other guys. How are they? Dustin's good. I mean, the protective gear they wear that a lot of people don't know about, he gets stepped on right in the middle of the back, which should have broke something. But with the gear he wears, he's bruised up pretty good. The leg's his biggest concern. We got stomped on in earlier rounds. So he's going to be limping a little bit, but he comes in for treatment. He's doing what he needs to. Definite professional. Tim O'Connell and Bareback, same deal. Young kid, but he's been in every morning, every afternoon, and we're getting him through it. All right, sounds good. Um, there you have it. Uh, two rounds left to go. Follow us tomorrow, and we'll be bringing it back to you again. Thanks for watching.